All right, all right. I'm out here heading toward Vernonia with my roomie, Mr. David Carter. Say what's up, David. What's up? We're heading out to Seaside and taking the coast today. On this, sun's supposed to come out later, but it's a little overcast right now. And we are just uh, riding this really nice curvy road. Man, it's nice. I'm enjoying this, David. This is the first time I've taken this road, man. I'm, I'm loving it, man. Yeah. So, I'm really lucky in, in uh, having a roommate that rides. And uh, sometimes on a, a Saturday, we're both off. We just kind of look at each other and be like, where are we going? That's and, it. And today we decided to head out to the coast. Um, so, how long, uh, you been, how long you been riding, David? Oh man, it's been two and a half years now. Two and a half years? Yeah. Yeah. See, so you you bought yourself your bike as a as a gift to yourself for getting your master's degree, right? Yeah. Ah. Uh, yep. See, that's what's up, that's David. What I wanted to do. Yeah. I've always wanted a bike, man, and um, finally bought me one. And David has a beautiful, beautiful. 2005 Harley Davidson Deuce and uh, everywhere he goes man people always make comments what a nice bike it is and my man just dressed it up with some white walls so it's looking gangster look at it y'all look at it 2005 Harley Deuce with the white walls um, that's a beautiful bike David thanks man and uh yeah, man. And David's a really smart guy, man. He said he's got a master's degree. David helps people for a living in an area that's uh, near and dear to my heart. He helps kids that are transitioning out of the foster care system. And uh, they age out, and he helps them get their lives together. And I think that, you know, not only is it is it uh, necessary, it's a very noble thing to do. You know, one of the things that I appreciate about my roommate is... Uh, He's just a really a kind spirit, man. He's a good guy. So, uh, yeah, man, I looked. I, I I hit I hit the mother load when it comes to roommates. <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah, but uh, that. yeah. So, but we have a good time together. And uh, yeah. this road is what's up. This is uh, this is part of the reasons, man. When I when I lived in when I lived in Nevada, man, you don't you don't get this. You don't get these roads like this. You know, so, uh, you know, these, these are good times. Look at this, man. This is just gorgeous. Yeah, it is, man. I, I'm enjoying the, um, the trees, how they cover the road. Man. Yeah. It's just nice, man. Yeah. It's just nice. And you this, know, just getting out on the bike, man, and riding and taking your time and taking in the scenery, man. Yeah. You know, it's just a, it's a beautiful thing. You know, sometimes some people get on bikes, man, and they just it, you know, to get to their destination. Yeah. But, you know, I think two and a half years I've been riding is just that I like to just get on, man, and take in the scenery, man, and then if there's something to catch my eye, I'm going to pull over and just enjoy it. For yeah. A while. Yeah, you know, and, and in what, about an hour, we're going to be standing next to the ocean, huh? Yep. See, that's what's up. Yeah. You know, um, I'm that's if that's if I don't see nothing to catch my eye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like right now, look at this. Even though you see the trees all torn down, but look at the scenery, man. Yeah. Look. They, look. Look where they logged that, man. They logged that. Look at that. Woo. Yeah, they did. That's crazy. But you know, the logging industry actually has a really good replanting program. Yeah, here in Oregon, most definitely. You know, so uh, they ain't they ain't running out of trees no time soon. Yeah. But most uh. Definitely. Yeah, man. A lot of this was old growth anyway, man. So, yeah. you know. And, uh, destiny, you know, whoever owns it, most likely probably Warehouser or Caney owns it. So they got to take care of it. Yeah. And David, you're from Canton, Ohio? Yep. Born yeah. and raised. Yep. He's got a weird religion, man. He's an Ohio State fan. Yeah, I am. That guy bleeds Ohio State. That's the only thing that I that keep David from going riding. What? 
I said, that's one of the only things that'll keep you from riding. Yep. If Ohio State's playing. <laughs> like, hey. Yeah, when Ohio State's playing, man, I gotta watch the game, man. I gotta watch the game. <laughs> you know, I got a, uh, I got a uh, family that all played for them, man. Yeah. Um, and everything, and um. So when it comes down to the Ohio State, I'm faithful, man. Yeah. Yeah. My, my um uncle and um used to take us to the games all the time and. Cleveland Brown games and stuff, and uh, football is just a thing, man. Yeah, we, we we won't talk about Cleveland right now, right? No, we ain't gonna talk about Cleveland right now. <laughs> David, d- David's a little upset with Cleveland right now. I'm still on the fence with them right now. <laughs> you ain't leaving Cleveland Browns, man. Yeah, I'm still on you the are fence. not leaving the Browns, right, man. You 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 mm-hmm. you're just mad right now. <laughs> I, I know, I'm just mad. You know, so, hey. So anyway, y'all, I just wanted to to y'all to meet another one of the guys that I spent a lot of time riding with a good dude and uh, that's what's up man it's about the pe- it's about the ride and it's about the relationships y'all yes it is yes it is it's about the ride and the, the relationship man yeah. you know the motorcycle thing is I've, I've missed out on many years yeah. but, uh, but you're here now now I'm in it and uh, I plan on staying in it and I plan on keeping this bike, you know, yeah. keep it going and stuff. Um, I'm just a modest dude, and but yet I like a little bit of style too, you know. Oh man, that that, that bike is that bike is slick. Yeah, it thanks, is man. slick. So, yeah. but to all you riders out there, ride safe. Yeah, ride safe. Ride safe, man. Take care of each other. Be kind to each other. All right, bless. Bless. I'll holler y'all later. All right. All right.